Hello guys, welcome to episode 14 of the Much and Glad Back Mission. It's me, Bad Jokes FM, back at you once again with another video. As you can see, it's the 8th of April 2023, so we haven't moved much since you were last with me, where we did have an absolute horror show in my 13th episode of this season. We lost 6-1 to Salka and then 3-1 to Leverkusen. If you want to see anybody have some FM rage, go back, watch that video. I had an absolute meltdown. But we are here today with the one game for you guys. We're playing against Bayern Munich, picking straight up from last time. Let's go straight to the team and see who's going to be taken to the field to try and rescue our season. As you can see, I've gone for a bit of a different formation. I think the 4 2 3 1 has had its day for the time being. So we're going back to 4 4 2 on the old counter. We've got Landra in goal, Galloway at left back, Moreno and Yaskar and Yasar Topkula. News right back, right back slash central defender. Keys coming into the side, Raphael at right back. And then Kaleska on the right wing, Gordino and Fassin in the centre of midfield, Lanzini, the man cross on the left wing, and then up top we've got Villaba and we've got Fabian Rees. Rees only making his second appearance of the season. He's only played one game in the German Cup for us. He's not appeared in the league as yet. He's only in the team because Musa Silla is still injured. He's still got a bit of a knock. He'll be back in a couple of days. Or tomorrow, in fact, but just not fit enough for this game. So let's hope he can take his chance and go and grab us a couple of goals. And as you can see, Bayern Munich, they're playing the 4 2 3 1. That's what made me change from the 4 2 3 1 of ours, the narrow one, to the 4 4 2. I've been getting caught going wide too often, so I want to try and limit that and see if we can just get this a draw. A draw is what I will take. Nil-nil. Well, not nil-nil. I want like a 1-1 one, one at least for a couple of goals for you guys. But a draw I will take. And meter prediction is saying they fancy Bayern to win this one. People will say Bayern have got a recent poor away record. But we've been struggling of late. And our task is not going to be made any easier by the absence of Patrick Fritz and the robot Bender. And as you can see, Bayern are right behind us in the table. A win today for them possibly jumps them above us, depending how many they beat us by. And I'm just going to send my assistant to deal with that. And then as ever, just going to go concentrate on the central players in this team. And as far as the team talk, I'm going to say to them assertively, um, what do I say? Assertively, I know a lot of you will be keen to avenge what happened when we last played Bayern. And that's got the majority of them motivated. Let's hope that works and we can get three points. And as ever at this point in the video, just want to say thank you to everybody who has been watching and subscribing and following me on Twitter. It does mean an awful, awful lot to me. As we're recording this, I'm at 92 subscribers. So I'm so, so tantalizingly close to getting to the 100 so if you haven't yet and you're enjoying this video and you're enjoying the series, please hit that subscribe button now. There are some really cool things coming up on the channel soon. That's not cool. Bayern have scored already. Briel and Bolo. Everybody knows about him. And he's given Munich the lead here. Let's... Here we go. It's Bolo with the ball. Plays it to Cortino. And Cortino... Oh, how on earth do you defend against that? He's backheeled that fantastically. Nothing our defence really could have done there, I think you'll agree. And now second highlight of the game, 28 minutes in, Bayern again coming forward, Lewandowski with a ball to, to Chechi, and he has the shot and Landra parries it over the bar. We survive for the moment. Can we just survive to half time? Now it's Cortino with a corner, and he whips it in, and Lewandowski with a header, and he just goes over the bar. And okay, that is half time. 45 minutes gone. We're one nil down. But if you look at the match stats, we've each had eight shots, both four on target. We've had more of the ball. So why we've not had any highlights for us, I'm not sure. 
but I am just going to go a bit more attacking. I'm going to go control, see what that does. And also I'm going to say to the lads, you've not been good enough. I expect to see a much better sewing. And that's again got them all motivated. Let's just see what that can do. Go control and fluid. And just hopefully, hopefully we can pick up a result. Now it's Neuer with a free kick. It's Hummels now. Under a little bit of pressure. Goes back towards Manuel Neuer who plays it long. Fussin heads it down but only goes to a buying player. Cortino to Lewandowski. To Regal. And wide to Kimmich. And what's Kimmich going to do? He goes to Cortino. Cortino with the ball to Vigel. And Vigel plays it wide to Kimmich, who's in a great deal of space there. This is not looking good. And Bolo with a ball now. And Landra with a fantastic stop to get the ball out for him. And that's Cortino again with the corner. He whips it out. And is Hummel's going to get to it? Nope. We head it away. But only as far as Mbolo in space. Surprised he didn't hit that first time. He goes wide to Cortino. And Cortino crosses it. And Landra, thankfully, the deflection does not take the ball away from him. And now Galloway with a throw in. Are we finally going to get an attacking highlight in our favour? Galloway plays it to Fassin. Fassin with the ball. Come on, can he find a teammate? He does. He goes to Lanzini. Lanzini with a ball. He's got himself a bit of space here. Oh, Noya with a stop. And it goes out for a corner. But if it's going to be anyone getting us back into this game, surely it's going to be the man crush. And Gordino with a corner. He whips it in. And Hummels heads it away. Reese picks it up there. And come on. He goes wide to Gordino. Come on, cross it first time. He does. But he gets headed away by Mbolo. But this is a nice bit of pressure from us. Fassian with the ball. Wide to Kaleska. Kaleska into Reese. And Reese, don't go to pieces, mate. Kaleska, come on. Oh, he loses the ball there to Mbolo. And Cortino on the counter. And could Bayern out of nothing score another one here? Cortino with the ball. Come on, take it off him. Galloway does. Right on the opposite side of the pitch. 67 minutes gone. Do I make changes? That was just a nice period of play there. I think I'm going to go attacking and see who we've got on the bench. And the answer is not a great deal. Uh, what do you do here, lads? I'm going to bring... Do I bring Egeria on? I can bring Egeria on for fashion. He's not done too much today. And then anything else we can do? I don't think there is, to be honest. Where is Silla when you need him? Wow. Okay. And do I bring Sol Solgado on? No, leave it at that. That's all we can do for the time being. But I think go. Maybe try going like that. Just leave Gordino as an anchor man on defend and Ijaria on attack. And just see if that does anything. You might be able to tell I'm getting a little bit desperate here. Do not want three defeats on the spin. And now 20 minutes left. Cortino with a corner. Gets headed in and Muller. Oh, surely he was offside. Oh, it's being given. Giuliano Cecchi with his fourth of the season has just scored from pretty much on the line. I think that ends this game as a contest. I see this in the 3D. Cortino whips it out. Hummels heads it in. Muller flicks it in and Chechi there. He was never going to miss. Okay, lads. About 12 minutes left and I'm going for it. I'm just going all out. Going to go overload. Normal tempo. Very narrow. Just pump the ball forward. Hit early crosses. Suit on sight. And I'm going to go be more expressive. Yeah, be more expressive. And also, you can see there, we've gone 4 1 3 2. Very attacking. Can we just get a couple of goals? Surprise them here with this new formation. And the answer to that question is no. As now it's Alaba with the ball, throws it in. Ijaria wins it back off him, but Reese just cannot get to the ball there. Sadebi to Koretska. Koretska to Embolo. Embolo back to Sadebi. And coming forward with the ball. He plays it to Sergi Roberto. And he goes, tries to play it long. And Sechi's in there. What has Raphael done there? That's 3-0. That's three defeats on the bounce. Our season is all but over. We're not getting into the Champions League now, surely. We might only be three points off it. But you've got to wait for Selka. 
capitulate. You've got to wait for Hamburg to lose a couple. And now Bayern have gone above us. This is not a very good game. As the referee, just blow your whistle. As Moreno there, is he, is he going to get himself sent off? Just to absolutely make my day? No, he's not. The referee takes pity on him and us and finishes the game there. I'm going to say to the lads, I'm not happy with your performance. And they're looking fired up and motivated. And hopefully they will be for the next game, which is a very big game now. We're playing Hamburg, who are fourth in the table. Next up, I'm not going to bring you that one because I've brought you three games in a row, all back to back to back. Hopefully we can win that game though. But I will bring you the Hamburg German Cup game just because that's a game that I think is more important to our season now. I think we've got more of a chance of winning that particular competition than of finishing third in the table. And so, if you've enjoyed that video, please let me know. Please give me a thumbs up down below. You may have noticed I've got a new microphone. I uh, hope you're enjoying the new audio. If you are, please let me know. If not, again, please hit me up in the comment section. Hit me up on Twitter so I can know how to improve things. And also, follow me on Twitter anyway, just because it's got some really cool stuff coming up in the next couple of weeks. And also, subscribe to me on here. Get me to that 100 total, please. I would love to get to 100. Never thought I'd ever be this close to it. So if you've enjoyed this video, whack that button for me, guys. And so with all that said, uh, I am Bad Jokes FM. I am out.